Welcome back to Pathologic 2. It's 11 a.m. on day 9. This is Olongo or Abattoir Day. The military just arrived at 7.30. Uh, in last episode, we gave immunity boosters to a crap ton of people. I think there's 10 people to give immunity boosters to, and I think I've delivered 8, I think. I want to say 8. Now, in route to helping out some other people. We're at the town hall, need to talk to General Block, and also get our reward from the fund. My arms are stiff. I'm listening. I'm a doctor who's making a cure for this plague. Ah, I remember now. You were in the report. What means are currently at our disposal to combat the outbreak? Briefly, please. I have a recipe for a serum, but it's useless. Go on. It requires blood of an unknown nature. What kind of blood does it require? Blood of an unknown creature, most likely an animal. Don't give me those tall tales. What was it? Bura? Artemy Bura? Correct? Correct. How can we find the source of this blood? All blood seeps from Olongo. What does that mean? I haven't really figured it out myself yet. Listen, Bura. Am I saying it right, Bura? Our unit has no medical personnel. We were sent here but naked. I'll figure out later if it was insanity, negligence, or premeditated crime. But right now, we need you to give us everything you have. Do I make myself clear? Crystal clear. You no longer work in the hospital. Your only job is to find the raw material for the serum in sufficient quantities to protect the town. I don't need samples or some proof of concept. I need a train car full of your cure. If we don't find it in two days, I will have to bombard the town. Those are my orders. Do I make myself clear? What? Let them burn in hell. But orders are orders. We're military, Bura. We don't debate orders. The extreme lethality and unclear origin of your disease demands the full destruction of your town as a transport junction and settlement. We must create an exclusion zone. Do I make myself clear? Yes. I have a question. Dismissed. You're under an obligation to report to the headquarters immediately if summoned and to carry out any order I give you. The army commissions you. For now, your goal is to find the missing serum component in significant quantities. That's it. You're free to go. Well, if you ask so nicely, General Ashes. So that entire conversation, I think, was different from our last playthrough. Because before, we didn't have a panacea at this point. First time we got a panacea was after we went to the Abattoir a long ago. So that was on day 10 when we came out and actually made the panacea for the first time. Here to get coupons. Yes, thank you. Name and occupation. Oh yeah, you're the manager. I'm the doctor. Mm-hmm. Local public fund will now be managed by the military. Okay, great. Holy crap. That is a lot of stuff. I'm actually very hungry. Oh, and I still have this fragrant note on me. I guess I forgot to put that back. It doesn't matter. I'm just going to drop it right here. Let's eat the biggest food first. Two fresh fish, that'll probably be enough. Almost. Good enough. Guess I'll take the rest with me. Yeah, I certainly have the room. Headed over to Yulia's place, since they're infected. Won't use my one schmouter on them. We've got a bad boy here, though. I think. 
Wait a minute, I do have a lockpick I want to use up, right? I don't think that's going to break in one hit, so I want to use it up until it will break in one hit. Come here. Yep, almost did it, but didn't quite. So let's use this one too. Oh shit. Holy shit, okay, hold on, whoa. Whoa, this went bad. Bandage. 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 They both have knives. Shouldn't have messed around with that lockpick. Didn't I break it on them? How come they didn't die? Lancet time? I could use a shotgun. <gasps> no! That's my first death. Damn. I didn't hope, I mean, I didn't think it was realistic to get through the game without any deaths. But the fact that I got to day nine before even getting a single death made me think, you know what, maybe I can do this. But nope. Deaths won. Let's try this again. Oh, there's a soldier shooting him this time. Well, that makes this easy for me. Thanks. And they don't loot bodies. Let's give Yulia a schmouter. And then there will be no infected pe Wait a minute. Wait, I thought I had a schmouter. Didn't I buy one from the dead item shop? Did I use it on something and forget? Right, well, I'm gonna hope that I'm able to come back here later with a schmouter if I find one today. But let's assume that I'm not going to do that, so let's treat them. I can still give them a miracle even after I've treated them with medicine. Oh shit, this is the only tincture I have at all. This is one medrol plus. I had to use some, uh, drink some of my own because my immunity was just completely gone at some point. I think it was off camera. Yas. Okay, I've got some really good Yas antibiotics. Yeah, this is made from brain tissue. You should have a very good chance of survival from this. Yeah. That's a very good chance of survival. I'm gonna take a boat down to my place so I can brew some more tinctures. Then I'll go up here and give some to Anna Angel. Let's do some repairing. Let's do my gauze mask. Okay, good. Got that up to max. I don't think that's worth doing, because I'm pretty sure I'm not going to be able to repair it again. I only have one red thread. Oh, hey, I can fix my shotgun. Yeah, when it's this high, it doesn't require uh, a toolkit. Okay. I don't know if I'm... I doubt I'm going to fire this thing enough to actually need to get it up to full durability. Although I wonder if that does increase reliability. You know, at what point does it start getting unreliable? Whoops. I still can't do the inventory upgrade because I don't have the cloak, but the cloak should be available now, now that the soldiers are here. I need other clothing too, like my boots ripped a long time ago, my gloves are about to go. I want one of those army cloaks for myself. And uh, I can't sharpen any of my stuff, right? Because I don't have any grindstones. Yeah. Let's do some potion brew. Tincture brewing, I mean. Got eight swivery, so let's just make all of those. Then I should make some of the other colored ones as well. Um, I have a, I actually have one white whip. I thought I had an ashen swish, yeah. Do I have the water for this? Yes, I do. I'm going to start uh, trading my water bottles for bandages when I see the people that can do that, by the way, because I have so many water bottles in here, I am never going to use these up for the whole rest of the game. There's not much of the game left, just a couple days, really. I guess three full days? Day 9, day 10, and day 11? And then day 12, you don't need any resources? Unless something different happens this time? I don't 
think that'll happen though. Anyway, yeah. Yeah, that's good. I do unfortunately need to sleep. My exhaustion is maxed out. So let's take uh, do I have a good painkiller, heart tissue, kidney tissue. Yeah, I got one made from a heart. Let's do three hours. Should get rid of almost all my exhaustion. And max health. Yeah, it's pretty good. Hey, partner. Whoa. Jesus Christ. Did you have to come around the corner like that? Oyun summons you. He said, if Tanger Burach doesn't come, tell him I'm not long for this world. If I die, so will the answers he seeks. Did my words reach you? Yes, and this never happened before. Is he still staying in my father's house? He lost a lot of blood, Emshin. You should sew him. You know how. Wait, is this about sewing up the wound that they completely forbid me from taking a look at? The one I tried to help them with, but they wouldn't let me? And now you're like, well, I've been slowly bleeding for a couple days. I'm gonna die. Please help. Got a thousand yard stare. Must have seen a lot of shit. Sing a song. I have an ear for music, but the voice, it could use work. Foreman Oyun wants to see me. That's a very generous way of saying they're bleeding to death. Uh, well, I was going to go down to Sawa's place first, but I don't want them to bleed to death, obviously. So let's go there now. Right now. On the way there, just going to stop at some stores. This pharmacy has a couple bandages. I want to stock up on those. wonder how many bandages makes up a stack. Probably five. And I don't need anything else here. Clothes store. Do you have the coat? Damn, you don't. But you do have boots at least, so I'm definitely going to buy those. And thread. Also stopping at Anna's place because it's right next to where Oyun is. They need an immunity booster. Hey creep, how's it going? Let's go help out Oyun. There you are. Okay, you're not dead yet. She is a herald of the law. Now, we come to the time when deities begin to die. Time for you to go to Alongo, the abattoir. Is the path to the blood clear? Behara, you still do not understand. You need to find the blood yourself. See it with your eyes. Touch it with your hand. Taste it with your tongue. All I need is a material for a cure. Taneg. Then what's the matter? You'll get it. Alright, I'm going. There, inside, you'll understand why your father did the deed for which he was killed. I think you will. Do you know who killed him? All answers lie in a long go, kindred. If you return alive but still confused, I'll try to explain it. If I'm not dead by then. Alright. My advice, a longo means ford. We come inside light and gutted. Better not to take anything with you. What you cling to will fall from your hands there. Don't be scared of that. If you mount the ford, they will return, and you will understand. Fine. Okay, I'm sorry, I thought you were bleeding to death. And then I come here and they don't even mention it? I... Alright. Took a boat over to the cathedral because we have a couple things to do here. Report to Aglaia and something is calling me here. Probably bad grief. By calling me, I mean the, the town is calling me. 21, 34, 55, enough. 
How goes the search for raw materials for your panacea, Bura? Have you found the bulls? We can no longer wait. I was told you were seized by the soldiers. They wouldn't dare. For now. I don't think they ever will. They have orders to level the town. Mine are to eliminate the source of the outbreak while preserving the town. So their arrival is my death sentence, and I cannot stop them. This brings us back to the subject of the panacea. I got no new ideas. And I was counting on you. Thought you were our best bet. Very well. It's good at least one of us still has their wits about them. I have an idea, thanks to Dankovsky. Did he make his vaccine? No, but he drew my eye towards that impossible structure. He's in love with it, I think. Particularly with how it stands straight without touching the ground and is impenetrable to the disease. Yes, the disease is tied to the earth. Precisely. Meaning? I don't know. The tower is connected to the source of the outbreak, Bura. Connected? How? Somehow, Bura. If the impossible suddenly becomes possible, someone must have paid a steep price indeed. The cost of such feats is usually measured in blood. Blood. Well, yeah. Blood. Blood. I keep searching for it. I know this all has to do with blood. If there's blood, there's a panacea. If there's a panacea, I'll have reason to silence the cannons. I'll report that the disease has been cured. I'll be saved too, but that hardly matters. The town will be saved. I'm happy to see you weren't actually arrested. Polyhedron defies the law of gravity, but it's still connected to the Earth. Everything is. The wench has us all over a barrel. Nothing to be done about it now. We need to escape, Cub. Escape. Where to? It's the only way to escape, don't you get it? Fate belies freedom. You're a toy, and you can't become human while you have a fate. So you must break it. That's what your old man wanted from you. What do you know about what he wanted? He tried to break his fate, and the fate of the town. So he died. What are you going on about? Are you completely daft? I've been telling you for like an hour. You aren't alive while you're part of someone else's design. Do you get it? That's why the sand pest came upon us, mown us down, and we do nothing. How could we? Just toys. Hmm. Well, maybe you're right. Grace? They'll kill us all. They'll spare no one. I'm so happy you're still alive. Are you looking for shelter too? But you can't hide in the cathedral. Only in the tower. Or on the tower, anyway. I'm glad you're alive too. Everyone is gathering in the tower. Me, I'm mustering up the resolve to follow. It's not easy. I'm very scared of heights. Who's gathering in the tower? All the town's children, bit by bit. The tower accepts kids, you know. It will protect us. They're on the stairs now. Oh, this is new. This never happened before. I hope you're right. Children are gathering atop the polyhedron. Do I have to go all the way to the top? I mean, I suppose I do have time. There's... Mm, I mean, there's a couple other things I need to do for today. No, like, quest stuff, really. The town is calling me in various places, but I feel safe to ignore those. Haven't had much luck with the caches in the past. Usually there's just nothing of any significance in them, really. So all I need to do really is treat Saba, right? 
Saba needs to be treated. Yeah, that's it. Saba is the only one left that needs to be treated. And I intend to do them on the way over to the abattoir. So yeah, I think I have time to go to the top. I do want to save first, though. I'm going to go save in Georgie's place. Although, actually, hold on. There's some kids just down here. The two extra creepy ones. Maybe I just need to talk with them. Oh, yeah, look. There's kids all up there. No grown-ups allowed up there. This place is dangerous. It's dangerous for you, but not for us. How are you special? We're from the inside. You won't understand. We can barely wrap our heads around it ourselves. From the inside? Why did you come out then? We're scared of the cannon, and we're afraid for the tower. If they start firing, it could collapse, you know, or fall, or rip apart. Basically, it can die. If it falls, it won't be because of me. Let me through. If it falls, it will be because of you. I'm not that big. Well, alright. Go. You'll only see stairs and catwalks anyway. As opposed to... What do you see? You see something other than just stairs and catwalks? It's still marked on the map, too. Yeah, I'm gonna go save. On. This is it. No more games. No one needs us. Don't worry about us. Not many children are here so far, but more are coming. Everyone who's healthy. The Rose will protect us from the plague. The Rose? The Polyhedron. The Tower. The Wind Rose. I've never heard that term before. I refer to the Tower. The wind rose. You were so worried about safety, but now you're back. Changed your mind? Denkovsky said I was healthy. You do look healthy. There's infection below. That's why we're standing here waiting. The signs appear quickly. That's what the bachelor told me. This staircase is the best isolation ward available. We'll spend the night here. The sick will descend. Whoever remains on the staircase by the morning will go inside. Let me through. I want to talk to the others. Don't. For whatever reason, they love you. Send you all the hellos in the world. You. Don't breathe on them. You're the one who came from the square. Go back down. And don't return until this is all over. Tell them I love them too, and I do know why. The Pelihedron is the best possible isolation ward. Sand Pest, which comes from Earth, can't reach it. I think I even see Notkin up there. Capella? Yeah. Our polyhedron shuddered when this monster was dragged in. Tell them to leave. Now. The monster must be the cannon. Hey, buddy. Ooh. Packages are always exciting. I don't know what was in it. Something that stacked. The cache up here is marked. The town's calling me. It's on the way, so might as well. Can't really take any boats, unfortunately, over to my place. Because that's an infected district. This is an infected district, so I can't take that one. And honestly, taking a boat that goes all the way up and around and then back down is really inefficient. It might take just about as much time just to run. And I can get more things done when I run. Collect things, buy things, sell things, kill people. Scratched note. I'll lead you to the nest for a bunch of good feathers. No peanuts. Leave a stash in the leaving place by the root. Go. 
God, I wonder if I could do this. Bunch of good feathers. Feathers. I don't think feathers are an item in the game, though. Also, what the hell's the root? By the root, I... Tuh. Could it be, like, these things? Could that be the root? There's a cache right here. Oh, but again, feathers aren't an item as far as I can tell. I'll put that back. Just went back home, dumped off a little bit of stuff, ate some food. Now let's go treat Saba, and then we're off to the abattoir. Although, on the way there, the town is calling me here to this cache. Might as well check it out. Still no schnatter. Man, I have 21 of the finger fingernails. Alright, right outside of the abattoir. I drank and used a bandage just to make sure I'm the best I can be since I'm going to lose all of these inventory items when I go inside. There's nothing else to do. I have treated everybody. This is one I just have to wait for. You wait for answers to reconcile the schism in the kin. Town is calling me here to a cache, probably nothing there. Yeah, I'm ready to go. Let's go to the abattoir. Once again. <laughs>